everyone's having a fantastic day. Um, be sure to uh, hit that subscribe button and uh, subscribe to the channels and also uh, hit the notification bell so that you get a notification each and every time we open a upload a new video. Um, also, uh, be sure to smash the like button and smash the like button. If you like the content, if you find it useful at all, uh, we're going to be doing an unboxing here today. Uh, also, be sure to share the video with your friends who might be interested in the content. Uh, but without further ado, we're going to jump right in here. We've got an unboxing for the 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray with digital copy of Bloodshot starring Vin Diesel. Uh, this was a film that literally was in theaters, at least in my local area, for like four days before... Uh, the theaters all got closed for, uh, you know why, uh, but, uh, yeah, this was out in March. This was basically the first big summer quote unquote blockbuster that was supposed to happen. Unfortunately, uh, it didn't quite happen. Um, so I have not actually seen this yet. I actually had tickets to go see this film, um, and I, my tickets were for Wednesday, and Tuesday was the last day that they showed that the theaters were open, so go figure. Um, but, uh, yeah, this was supposed to get a re-release as well on, I think, just last week, but the theaters did not reopen. So, um, hopefully whenever the theaters do reopen, uh, Bloodshot gets a chance to have a theatrical run. I think it's only fair, um... You know, by that time, probably a lot of people will have the Blu-ray or 4K. Um, but I also, I also fear that the 4K Blu-ray sales will suffer because not a lot of people saw the film. Whether they like it or not, a lot of people like to collect action films. This is based on a graphic novel. Uh, graphic novel, to some out there, that's a comic book um, that you're not sure. Uh, but, uh, so there should have been a decent amount of interest. Uh, so... But that's a little backstory of Bloodshot, so let's tear right into it and see what we got here. Um, so as always, I've already pre-sliced the packaging with the old trusty knife there. So let's rip it open here and see what we've got. Um, I can tell you already, I love the matte finish that's on the Blu-ray, or on the Steelbook. Um, I absolutely like love that. And it even is like a textured matte finish. Uh, so very, very nice. Um, let's see, do we have anything up here hidden? Um, I've already gotten fingerprint oil on this thing. Well, yeah, there's a glue dot there. So we're going to have to do that a little bit in a little bit. But there's the front uh, with the top of the, with the upper third, the J card showing 4K Ultra HD. Blu-ray Digital, Vin Diesel, Bloodshot. Let's take a look at the top of the J-card. We've got Vin Diesel, Bloodshot. Um, so we'll take a look here at the spine. The spine is my biggest disappointment with this steelbook. And it's just a black spine. Although the Bloodshot does have the kind of matte chromatic finish as the cover where it does say Bloodshot. But the rest of it being solid black is kind of disappointing. I would have rather it kind of been this red color here or this you know textured uh splattering of the uh nano nanotechnology but whatever Let's take a look at the back here of the j card we've got a straight shot of adrenaline by brandon davis of comicbook.com um get a little closer look here hopefully you guys can read that special features is deleted and extended scenes including an alternate ending of course you know most of us did not get a chance to see this in theater so i have no idea what the original ending was anyway um outtakes and blooper reel uh initiate sequence directing bloodshot forgotten soldiers and the cast of bloodshot uh we're going to get a digital uh movies anywhere digital code um and so that's pretty much it on the J-Card. Um, I do believe this has an Atmos track. I cannot make out that. Again, it's so small. Um, but I'll be sure to um, look at the top of the screen here and I'll let you know uh, 
whether it does have a Atmos or not, but I'm fairly certain. I think I read that, but it's good. But let's go ahead and take a look at the back here um, and the back of the steel book shows you know the nano bites or particles nanotechnology coming off of his skin off of his face or returning uh i'm not sure which sequence this is because i didn't get a chance to see the film so it's either healing or it was just shot off but the way he's holding the gun it looks like it's a healing process so all right let's go ahead and flip the j card back over there um and we're not missing anything across the top. Uh, I'll pull the glue dot off just so you can see that for yourself. Um, there does have a picture of one of the little nanotechnology creatures up there. The nanobites or whatever. <laughs> Let's go ahead and pop it open. See what's on the inside. Um, we've got our digital copy there. Um, and on the back side, a promotion for Sony Rewards. Uh, but there you go. There's your uh, there's a digital copy. Um, I'm assuming I can't make that out, but it looks like some sort of firearm. Uh, I believe there's a grip stock and foregrip up there with an optic at the top. I, but I can't really get a hundred percent. But I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Um, we'll take a look here at this side, and we've got our. 4K Ultra HD disc, blood shot, pretty cool disc art. Um, put that over here. We'll pull out the Blu-ray now. Uh, I'll spin it around so you can see uh, the disc art before I take it out. There you go. Um, so yeah, that scene on the back looks like it's exactly as what's on the Blu-ray, and it's the particles returning to heal his face. But take a look, yeah, that's a picture of, of a gun here on this side because if you look here, you can see uh, multiple other uh, firearms or possibly the same firearm. Uh, they look to be very similar, different than the one over here, uh, but they all on the right side appear to be the same weapon. But again, you know, we're not getting a super clear look there so i'm not 100 percent satisfied with the interior artwork but it is what it is um so and as you can see here um those of you that have watched the bruce uh, bruce lee criterion um unboxing this is how i believe those uh clear cases should have been glued on so that you can just drop your disc in there falls right onto the the cedar and it just clicks right in very less chance of damaging the actual disc uh, so let's go ahead and put the 4k disc back in there and we'll just click that right in place and we'll rotate it around give you another look there at the uh, disc art but as you can see, uh, this is when he is shot and the particles are returning to heal him, the nanotechnology. Um, but that's it. That's the Bloodshot uh, 4K Ultra HD Steelbook. Uh, go ahead and put the J card back on top there. Give the glue a little impression and we'll set it up there. That's what you get with the uh, 4K Ultra HD uh, Steelbook of Bloodshot. So, all right. Uh, again, if you guys like the video content, uh, be sure to smash that like button and don't forget to smash the like button. Uh, if you found the content useful at all, please hit the like button for us. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so that you get a notification each and every time we upload a video. Um, also, share this with your friends so that they can see uh, if they're interested in wondering what comes with the Steelbook for Bloodshot. Alright, that's going to do it. Um, I want to encourage everyone out there to always, always, always keep it flashing forward. Take care, guys.